I've heard that some people like to use deck lid standoffs when trying to keep their VW engines a little cooler, especially in the summertime when you live in a hot area. People have talked about the tennis ball trick. That's to put a slit in the tennis ball, hook the slit over the latch, and have a deck standoff just like that. Trouble is the ball tends to slip upward and the lid eventually closes, at least on these older model VWs, 68s and above, that have the more flattened hood than, than do the original ones, the teardrop shape. So this doesn't work. So what I've done, because I wanted one that I could get on and off at will, was that I took a piece of 2x4, 11 inches, with a one and one half inch cut in the middle, a little bit of bicycle inner tube, which looks cheesy, but is good for resting the hood on top. It won't, won't take the paint off. And some rubber feet that sits on top of the paint down there by the deck lid latch. A router or a drill bit can cut the hole in the wood to fit over this right there, that deck lid latch. The cable is to keep it wrapped around the bumper and locked in place so in case of hitting a bump, the wood doesn't go into the deck, into your pulley, and potentially ruin a lot of mechanics. It fits on over this thing, the bumper, it's not, not a thing. And with a little safety catch, it stays in place until you need to remove it. Gives you about three inches or so of open air, so air can come through and take the hot air on out, and it seems to work pretty well. Plus, unlike having a mechanical deck lid um, spacer, you can open and close the lid whenever you want simply by moving the wood. The other ones that bolt into place are there permanently, and also unlike the ones that bolt up on the hinge, you don't have the deck lid sitting open in case of rain, so it works out well. Again, it works, it's cheap, and it's functional. Thanks.